East Coast news, big news. What's going on, people? I'm gonna be making a couple of videos today. I don't know when I'm gonna be posting them. Um, the one that I really wanna make is about September 11. Um, I was alive, been there, saw that, went through a lot of things. Um, I lived in one of the states where the planes came out of, but that's neither here or there. I just want the American people to know what's going on behind all this. You know, let the government do their thing, but those people that perished and died, we should honor them. And look at the family member next to you. Look at your kids. Look at everybody that you have around you and be thankful every minute off your day that you have them by your side because any of this silly, stupid stuff could pop off at any time. You never know where you are or what's gonna happen. Nothing, nothing is guaranteed. And now that these fools from the Middle East are let loose like a bunch of idiots, and all in the name of feminism. We wanted women in government in Afghanistan. 20 years of our soldiers dying just to get women in there. And did they want women running the place? Nope. And we like idiots sacrificed our boys. Yes. Hammerhand, you know what I'm talking about. Sacrificed our boys for what? For what? Thousands and thousands of lives lost. So, I don't want to hear anything about the government's bad, the government this and that. Forget about the government. They're going to do what they're going to do. And there's nothing that you could do to change that. Okay? But, there is something that you can do. And that is be grateful, take care of your family, females, you know what I got to say about that. Men, do your part and do not fail at being the head of the household. Guide your family towards success. And it doesn't mean having a six-figure salary. It just means that you're there through thick and thin for your family. If you have the right family structure. That's all. God bless. See you in the next video.